All right, so we're gonna do the unboxing of the of the Vive Pro kit. Um, tracking 2.0. Tracking 2.0. All right, let's let's go ahead. We got them early. Um, we're about 45 minutes away from the city of industry. So, and we're a location-based VR company. So we got two. Um, we're gonna see if it works with with the um, with the new four base station setup, four lighthouse setup. Okay. Does it have anything interesting? Does it mention the four base stations? So like it's just the room scale, um, the max between the base stations. It's only for two. It doesn't look too different from the gold values. Okay. Wow, oh, all well, organized. All right, what do we got? Oh, new base stations. Alright. See these. Yeah, let's take a look at these new base stations. It looks like they use the same power adapters as before. Okay. So that's convenient. Ho oh, hopefully they're the same. And the mounting equipment for it. Alright. The new link box is different. I don't know, it's like a giant proprietary plug on one end. Okay. And then they no longer do HDMI, it's just display port. Okay. More cables for it. Nothing here. This one's been out for a little bit. Yeah, it's the Vive Pro, the new super expensive one. One problem we're gonna see is we might have to use the link box to use it on our VR backpacks now, because it has proprietary cable at the end, it looks like. Okay. So more short cables for us, it looks like. Oh, this is like super padded. This is really thick padding on here. Yeah. Huh. And then the last but not least, the controllers. Oh, they have the same blue tint as the Vive Pro, but otherwise they look almost identical. Yeah, I heard that they improved some things about the trackpad on there. Oh, okay, so the trackpad's a little... They, they made it a little better. There were some issues with the previous one, so... Okay. Yeah. It feels a little smoother, to be honest, already. Like, it's not as matted. Oh, okay. Alright. Can you open up one of these base stations? Yeah. Alright, so let's see. Back to the base stations. Okay. Alright, so they're curved now. Can I unpeel that? Alright. On the back, it looks like they still have the same two spots for the camera mounts. Uh, power, micro USB for probably updating the firmware, and then probably still a sync cable, it looks like. Okay. Do they, can they daisy chain a sync cable? I'm wondering, no, because there's only one plug for a sync cable, so I wonder how that works. Yeah. Or if it's even necessary, excuse me, even necessary. Yeah. Which was the box of these. Right. It did not come with a sync cable, so I don't know what that's for. Okay. We'll find out. I guess we will find out. That's, that's pretty interesting. Okay, let's get it set up and see how it works.